Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to my YouTube channel, Life Science with KMD. Today, I am going to explain about micro-grafting, meristem culture and its importance. Micro-grafting consists of placement in the aseptic condition of maintained scion onto an in vitro grown rootstock. The result of in vitro micro-grafting and plant material derived from it can be further multiplied in tissue culture condition or acclimatized to outdoor condition. Micrografting is a technique that potentially can combine the advantage of rapid in vitro multiplication with increased productivity that result from grafting superior rootstock and scion combination. Among various methods of micrografting, slit or wedge grafting has been found most suitable in case of fruit crops. In vitro shoot tip are better as compared to in vivo shoot tip for carrying out micrografting result in higher graft success, less contamination, low shoot tip necrosis and good vigor of micrografts. It comprises the following steps. Aseptic condition was maintained throughout all the stage of micrografting process. Seedlings were removed carefully from an agar medium with sterilized forceps. For use of rootstock, seedlings were cut back to 1 cm above the cotyledonary nodules and leaves were excised using micro scalpel. Terminal shoot to be used as kion were excised from other seedling at 2 cm below the apex. Lower leaves removed from the base 1 cm of scion. Excised scion and the root stalks were stored in sterilized deionized water until the use uh, until used in grafting process. Shoot tip was inserted at the top of the decapitated root stalk by making an incision. The cortex was exposed by the horizontal cut of the incision. Grafted plant were cultured in liquid nutrient medium containing plant cell culture, salt solution of MS, modified whites, vitamins and uh, 75 gram per liter sucrose. When at least two extended, uh, two expanded leaves were formed, micrografted plants were transferred to plot uh, to pots containing a stem sterilized soil mixture suitable for plants. Importance Overcoming graft incompatibility Rapid moss propagation of elite scion by grafting into root stock that have desirable traits like resistant to soil borne pathogens and diseases. It allows survival of, diffic uh, of difficult to root and shoot. Development of virus-free plants. Meristem culture. Cultivation of axillary or apical shoot meristem, particularly the shoot epic meristem, is known as meristem culture. Meristem culture involves the development of an already existing shoot meristem and subsequently the regeneration of advantageous root from the developed shoot. It usually does not involve the regeneration of a new shoot meristem. Shoot apical meristem lies in the shoot tip beyond the youngest leaf or the first leaf primordium. It measures up to about uh, 10 uh, up to about 100 micrometer in diameter and 250 micrometer in length. Thus, a shoot tip of 100 to 500 micrometer would contain 1 to 3 leaf primordial in addition to apical meristem. Shoot tip culture is widely used for rapid cloning propagation for which much large example uh, 5 to 10 millimeter explants are used. Therefore, most cases of meristem culture are especially shoot tip culture. Nodal explant of various size are also commonly employed for rapid cloning propagation. Procedure for meristem culture Collect rapidly growing epics of the shoot. Remove all the leaves except the smallest leaves. Wash thoroughly under running water with a drop of between 20. Disinfect the working area of the laminar flow cabinet with 70% alcohol or rectified spirit. Dip washed explant in 0.1% mercury chloride solution for 5 to 7 times. 
for surface sterilization and wash with sterilized distilled water through thoroughly for 3 to 4 times place the shoot tip on sterilized filter paper hold the stem firmly with forceps and remove the young leaves with a needle remove the underlying leaf primordial gradu gradually remove up to 3 third or, or uh, 3 third and 4th leaf primordia and kept intact the first and second leaf primordia carefully without damaging the fragile doom shaped apical meristem with a surgical scalpel remove the apical doom uh, of about 0.1 to 0.3 millimeter transfer the doom to the culture tube containing medium the culture tube maintaining at 25 plus or minus 2 degree centigrade for 12 hour light that is um, 3000 lux per 12 hour dark cycle growth and development within 2 to 3 weeks of inoculation apical meristem grows and forms shoot each single shoot undergo proliferation these shoots are separated and cultured in rooting media rooting root initiation occur within 18 to 21 days of inoculation once the plantlet has two or three leaves and strong roots they are transferred to liquid basal medium with the help of a paper bridge after about eight weeks the plantlets are soaked in 0.2 percent bavistin as fungicide for 10 minutes and potted in vermiculite mixture till they grow importance of uh, meristem culture Pro uh, production of viral free germ plasm uh, mass production of desirable genotype Faci uh, facilitation of exchange between location like production of clean material cryopreservation that is cold storage or in vivo conservation of germ plasm can produce viral virus free plantlet for micropropagation and international exchange of germplasm. Virus uh, persist in the vegetative plant part which is um, used for propagation. Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe to my channel by clicking on subscription button. Subscription doesn't cost you any money. To get a notification, click on a bell icon. Do like and share this video with friends and family. If you have any kind of feedback, do share it on a comment box. Thank you.